on tip top moonwalking with church shoes y'all can cop some merchandise freddy hats freddy hoodies at feels right dot shop help support your boys and use code freddy f-r-d-i freddy at checkout for five percent off we love you enjoy the show welcome back to the number three podcast in the world my name is nick this is cakes are you ready freddy i'm ready freddy let's get the money pow pow bro what you got a new song coming out on Friday. Why do you do this? Do man? what, you, man? You, 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 man. <laughs> you got a new song. It's called Costa Rica, guys. For real, it's a really good song. Probably my best one yet. It's okay. Wow, I never heard you talk good about yourself before. It's probably my best one. Is yet. it? It's one of the only songs that you've made, and then like after some time has passed, you'd be like, "Yeah, I still like that song." It's still the hit. It's a hit. So it comes out Friday. Yep. This podcast will be released Wednesday. The pre-save campaign. Any, anyone listening? Anyone Whoa. listening? Go pre-save that joint. Whoa. Go pre-save that joint. Help your boy out, man. Where's the link? <laughs> okay. <laughs> you said, bro, don't be doing this. Link's in bio. <laughs> Link's in bio or description. Guys, check it out. It's called Costa Rica. It is a hit, bro. Hey. I can't even I can't even throw a joke, bro. It is really good. I feel it in my plums, you know? Like when it when it drops in. It makes my plums swell up. Yeah, I can tell. They get a little moist. Yeah, your pants are a little bit more tight than usual. So, mm-hmm. like, when that happens, I can definitely tell when it happens, you know? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah. yeah. Any other songs that you've made, like, recently that been not, like, that's not out yet that you're, like, damn, that is a good song? I'm retiring. <laughs> you're retiring. I'm retiring from music. Yeah. What What is an age that you'd be like, all right, like... I'm set. Like, I could retire. Maybe, like, five years. So, like, 28, probably. How long, How long? It, like, into retirement could you go to where you're bored and want to do something else? Do you Maybe think? Like, like, two hours? <laughs> I just between two hours and two days. Yeah. Because you tried to retire before. Well, I, you know, I took a retirement break. That's a vacation. I'm taking another one. No, I'm just going to go focus on something else, I think. I think I'm going to focus on teaching people how to do the music. Not yeah. how to make music, how to grow their music. That's yeah. what I'm going to do. That's my next step. That's my next step. I'm not really retiring from music. I'm still releasing music. I was just being sassy. I got some questions for you, man. I'm ready. <clears throat> Push come to shove, bro. Do you know how to change a tire? Shove. What? Like, push gun to shove, like... Shove. Dude, long story. <laughs> I'll tell you a story about yeah, this. Yeah, tell me about it. Of course I can change the tire. Have uh, you ever? Yes. Okay, let me... T- you can tell your story. Yes, I'm going to tell a story. So I yeah, go am, ahead. I'm 16, okay? I'm on what might be my first date with Amanda. Sure. And she's now my wife. And I'm in there with uh, her friend and her friend's boyfriend. Right. So I, uh, we get a flat tire, run away to the lacrosse game, we get a flat tire. Raining. My first date with Amanda. No one in the car knows how to do it. I hop out. Come on. You know, a little elbow come grease, on. you know? Yeah, come on. Do what needs to be done. Yeah. And, uh,. You go in the, you go in the, you went in the trunk and get that, get that tool out, that X tool, like it, like Look, it's Excalibur, bro. I'm just saying, that, I put, put it up. I put the donut on, and what? I got a little frosting. Okay. Wait, what? What? <laughs> you put the, you put the donut. I put the donut. The tie, you put the tire on, and then I got a little frosting. Like it, was, like it was cold out when you did it. I got a kiss. I got a kiss that night when we got home. Oh, bro. I'm Be- 16. Okay, you know, <laughs> kiss a big deal, you know. <laughs> Kiss is a big deal. Yeah, yeah, you know? yeah. And when we got home, it's our first date. Dang. I asked her to be my girlfriend in the car. Because. <laughs> smooched her up. <laughs> oh, my. Yeah. How, mu- how much of the of the you putting the tire on? Oh, got to be 90% of it. 90%. Got to be. So you think if you never changed that tire that you wouldn't be married to? I wouldn't have had the confidence to ask her that night, you know? Yeah. Yeah, I was, you know, when you're the only guy... Uh, when you're the only guy that that knew how to do it right. in the vehicle. Well, how many guys were there? Just two. So there's two me guys, two guys. Me and another. And you're 16. You, yeah. you do you even do you even have your driver's license at this point? You know what? At that point, I might not have. 
So you you were prepared for situations yeah. that you can't that you wouldn't personally ever yeah. run into. Yeah, that's a, you you like you're a prepared individual, man. Yeah, yeah. I like. Hey. You th- you threw the spare on there. You know I did. Yeah. The donut. Does the does the does that tool? What is that tool called? The X. You know what I'm talking about? Yeah. This is the thing that does the the, the lug Yeah. Nuts. All that's in the trunk, right? Depends on the vehicle. Yeah. I don't. <laughs> you you spitting facts all you know about, yeah, man. It depends on the vehicle. I've never changed a tire in my life. No. No, I think I could do it. Like I get the premise. I, I feel like it's not. It, not okay, that let's difficult. run through it. Let's okay. run through it. Yeah, sure. Uh, what do you do first? <clears throat> All right, let's role play. Okay. Flat tire. Ah, Again, yeah. Pull off. <sighs> stay in the stay in the car. <laughs> I got this. Keep the keep the kids in the back. I'm a yeah. I'm a handle this. I'm a, man. this. I'm a I'm a, I'll handle this. I'm a man. I'm a man. I'll handle Show this. Me. Yeah. Let me pop the trunk. Yeah. <clears throat> Gotta move some stuff out of the trunk. Yeah. There, usually it's underneath. It's like the floorboard. So you turn the thing, yeah, you pull the thing. Up. Up, yeah. You're gonna grab. You're gonna grab the spare tire. Yeah, just grab it. I just got the stuff already. You got the jack. You got the tire. Bring it. I out. just wanted to flex that I knew about the jack. <laughs> <laughs> there's a jack in there. There's the yeah. tool. There's a tire. So first, yeah. first, you're gonna put the jack. You're gonna lift it up just enough to where there's not a lot of pressure on the tire. Then you're gonna take the 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 bolt thing, the Excalibur guy. And you're gonna do it, but you're gonna do cr- crisscross applesauce all the way around it. Take each each you're each saying, bolt. You're saying the tire is uh, off the ground? No, not off the ground. It's just relieving. Well, I just get the stab, bro. You gotta take the hubcap off. <laughs> you gotta take the hubcap off. Just the hubcap before, is before, like the piece of plastic. Right before you jack the car up. Right. You loosen the lug nuts a little bit. Yeah. So that. When you go to loosen them, your tires mm-hmm, not just mm-hmm, spinning. See, on you. yeah, that's what I said. Exactly what I said. Yeah. Then you take it off. Yeah. You put the you put the spare on. Yeah. Reverse process. Done. Sure, man. I like it. That's a great job. <clears throat> yeah. I'm. Pre- pre- I've been preparing for this my whole life. You did great. Thank you. I think that I could get it on. I think so. Um. You could again. It. Never been tested. Yeah. No. You could. So, do it. All those. All those hours you spent on the road. Now we got flat tire. I know. Right? Sorry I'm about crazy. the one you're getting today. What's up? Sorry about the one you're getting. Today. Don't don't throw that karma on me. I didn't bro. do it. You, you just threw it. that karma. You on said me. I've never got a flat tire. And then you I knocked on wood. On yourself. And then I knocked Did on wood. Did you knock on wood? In my head. Mm. <laughs> mm-hmm. <laughs> Have you ever picked up a hitchhiker? Mm. Hmm. Someone else did. Brought While back, you were in the car? Brought back to the house I was living at. Really? What's the story behind that? Is crotch discomfort hurting your game? Fear no more. The kings of crotch comfort, Manscaped, have spent two years designing the most comfortable boxer briefs out there. Sleek, soft, comfortable, and flexible. The brand new boxers 2.0 from Manscaped take your balls to the royal ball throne. The global leaders in below the waist grooming have the lawnmower 4.0 for the trimming, so you can wear the boxers 2.0 for the chilling. They even trademarked the jewel pouch, so you know it is serious. I think it's time you invest in your family jewels, so let your bulge breathe and get 20% off in free shipping by using our code FREDDY at manscaped.com. For real, the Boxers 2.0s are great. I wear them. They're comfortable. They are great boxers from the bottom of my heart. Get 20% off and free shipping with our code FREDDY at manscaped.com. That's 20% off and free shipping with our code FREDDY, F-R-D-I, FREDDY, at manscaped.com. Up your crotch game because once the Boxers 2.0 touch your sack, you'll never go back. Back to the show. I don't know. He was just doing the Appalachian Trail or something. Brought him back, gave him a steak. Wow. Took him back. Would you ever pick one up? Depends. Most yeah. likely, no. Like if you had a pickup truck, sit in the bed? Most likely, no. And and that's a bummer, right? Because I would love to. Yeah. But it's you hard. just don't know. It's hard, bro. You just don't know. Okay. You know? What, if, uh, what, if, what if, you know, three days from now, you see me on the side of the road, but I'm covered in blood. Would you pick me up? Yeah. It's my boy, bro. Yeah, I'd pick you up. <laughs> All right, what if I what if I'm like covered in blood, 
but I'm holding like a chainsaw covered in blood. I pull up. <laughs> I pull up. Uh huh. Okay. What if you see me covered in blood, chainsaw covered in blood? Mm-hmm. I'm like Nick. I just did something bad. Go ahead and shut that chainsaw off, <laughs> and we'll talk about it. Are you rolling up window cracked or window down? No, I'll go halfway down. Halfway down? You, halfway, ain't, going, yeah. you ain't going full way down? No, halfway down. Yeah. Yeah. Halfway down. <clears throat> Cakes, if you wouldn't... Uh, what's going on? Uh, what's going on, buddy? <laughs> you, uh, it's hard to hear you, man. Can you turn the... Can you put yeah, the I, can, window all the way yeah, down? No, I did I, something I, bad. I can barely... If you just want to turn the, the chainsaw off... I, get, I can't do that. I can't hear you all that well? I can, yeah, you might want to roll the window down. It's because of the chainsaw. <laughs> now, if you just roll the window down, I think you'll be able to hear me. But I can't turn this off because I've turned it off. I'll I can't call turn it back you. On. I'll call you. You gotta call me. Mm-hmm. It's cold outside. <laughs> <laughs> then I give you. a call. Have you ever? Have you ever hitchhiked? No, I never hitchhiked. Would you ever? Because I feel yeah. like it's always the the idea of like, don't pick up a hitchhiker because they could be dangerous. But also, don't ever hitchhike because that's dangerous. What if there's oh, yeah, a situation buddy. where both the hitchhiker and the hitchhikey are, are both, both like, dangerous? Both dangerous. Whoa. <laughs> what happens in that situation, bro? Whoa. That's like, like of all the times this ever happened in, in life, that's had to happen at least once. One of them got to be playing the long con, right? Like, <laughs> yeah. Committing to the innocent vibes. <laughs> you know, hey, thanks so much for. Picking me up. And the other one's playing the same thing. Oh, yeah, no problem. Yeah, and they're all, they're thinking like, I'm going to eat this guy tonight. <laughs> you know? I don't know why they're cannibals, but. Yeah, no, I, I, was, I, mean. I was going more like Chainsaw about I it. I tried to watch that show, Can Cannibal, Hannibal, Hannibal, Hannibal the Cannibal. i never seen it, man. I tried to watch it. I had to Like stop. Hannibal Lecter? I liked watching it. Yeah. But I had to stop because, uh, man, it freaked me out a little too much. <clears throat> Do you think there's more signs or light bulbs in the world? Signs, you said? Signs or light bulbs. Signs, you said. Yeah. Like, you know, room 288, room 289. Sure. Stop sign. Uh, McDonald's sign. Uh, you know, um, any signs, man. Wow. Are there more signs or light bulbs? Man. I thought about this. I was driving. I was parked at a street light. It was like three street lights, but there's also like three signs. Yeah, but there's three lights inside of each street light. That's what I'm saying. Mm-hmm. Right yeah. here. All those little tiny light bulbs is each an individual light bulb. Yeah, no, this is a tough one. I would I would guess light bulbs. <sighs> really? I just feel like signs guess. have been around longer over the course of history. Like light bulbs are a newer thing, right? Yeah, Abraham Lincoln set him up. Sorry? He's big on the light, the light thing. Abraham Lincoln? He, there was this comedian. He said, uh, he said, I was uh, staying at the Presidential Hotel here yeah. in D.C., and they have quotes on the wall. No, the qu- quotes on your key card, right? <laughs> and uh, and uh, this one on his key card said, uh, whatever you are, be a good one. Abraham Lincoln. <laughs> and he was like, really? He gets to take credit for that? He's <laughs> like, hi, how are you? Abraham Lincoln. <laughs> I don't remember who said it, but it was funny. <laughs> Maybe Mike Berbiglia. Maybe Mike Berbiglia. Yeah. Berbiggle bug, Berbigliography. You're big into stand up? Big? I don't know about big. You enjoy it. I like clips. Yeah. Uh, I don't often commit to. It's tough, bro. It's like a, what do they call it? A special. A special. I don't know if they commit to a full special. Yeah, because specials used to be big. Like, I feel like two thousand to like two thousand ten, like Comedy Central, the specials were crazy. Like everyone had like the thing for comedians. I feel like was to get on Comedy Central, like their specials. Mm. Um, and there really isn't that. I guess there it is on like Netflix would be the next kind of thing. Um, but yeah, yeah, I haven't really watched even like comedians that really like Theo Vaughn. I haven't I haven't watched this full special. Or like yeah, I like him on the fly. Yeah, off the dome, Theo's the, f- the funniest person I think I know, bro. Yeah, I like him on the fly I like that. <clears throat> if you dedicated your life right now 
Do you think that you could be a professional volleyball player? Yeah. <laughs> that was so fast, bro. Yeah, I thought you were going to say something difficult. <laughs> <laughs> no, a professional volleyball player. <laughs> I play. could be in the Olympics. <laughs> if I dedicated my life, I would be in the 2028 Olympics. 2028. So you think that you could... My second question was going to be how long until you were able to do it. You You think in six years... You could be a professional volleyball player. Six years, I'll be 27 years old. I'll be in my prime peak. <laughs> Dog, don't make me do it. <laughs> don't make me do it. I'll be in my peak athleticism. You're going to be 36. In what? In, Six in, years. In 20 years? <laughs> I'll be 36. All right. uh, yeah, I could be a professional volleyball player. Would you sure. play like the duos kind of thing? I don't know what that means. You talking like, about like in the sand? Yeah, in the no, sand. I think my, knee, my knees, you know. I don't like sand is hot. Yeah. I got a little I got a little baby feet when it comes to hot sand. Okay. And most times they're playing outdoors. You're temperature adverse. Some yeah. Yeah. Heck yeah. <laughs> Do you think you'd be the better at like the setup guy or like the spiker type? I'm guy? the spike guy, for sure. You're the spike guy. Yeah, I'm I'm purebred. I might have to lose about uh, 30 pounds. But. I mean, but you got six years, so you should be able to do that, right? Well, uh, yeah, I'm going to the 2028 Olympics. That'll be my last performance. That's when I'll retire. Oh, I'll, I'll, I'll win so many tournaments. What Le- about volleyball makes it so easy? Leading up to that? Uh, no, it's volleyball. I'm not saying volleyball is easy. I'm saying it's easy for me. <laughs> Why? I lied. <laughs> I'd like to know about why. I'm just, you know, long. (laughs) What happened, bro? Next question. Bro, would you rather have crocodile teeth or spider hands? Uh, what does that mean? Like I can climb walls? <laughs> like exactly what I said. Can I climb walls? Exactly what, you, what I said. I'm asking you, do I have spider man's hands or do I have spider hands? You have spider hands. Like, so no hands. <laughs> yeah, but you have sticky abilities. But I have no hands. I just have wrists <laughs> at that point. Yeah. I have wrists with little tiny little sticky fingers on them. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> give me the teeth, <laughs> bro. Think about it. You're not gonna be able to eat vegetables ever again, bro. You're gonna what be are you talking about? Because if you get if you get crocodile teeth, bro, you're gonna be you're gonna turn into a carnivore. Crocodiles are herbivores. No, they're not. Bro. Definitely omni. <laughs> you're not De- omnivores. I seen a I seen a uh, alligator eat a bagel. Not on purpose. An alligator. I seen one eat a bagel. Not on purpose. How you gonna tell me? <laughs> what do you? Did you? Where Where did you see a crocodile Florida. eat a bagel, bro? Florida. Flo Rida. Flo Rida? You saw Flo Rida eat a bagel? No, I seen an alligator eat a bagel in Flo Rida. In Florida, you saw an alligator eat you a never, bagel. You never Did been, you throw a bagel into the water and eat never, a bagel? You never been to the Everglades? Blueberry bagel. Okay. Bodos. Bro, spider hands? You could climb up walls. You, you don't have, have spider hands. You could hold so you many more things. You said you have a spider's hands. You could hold so many more things. No, not with a spider's hands. You get eight of them. I... Am I giving me Spider Man's hands or am I getting a spider's hands? The question said crocodile teeth or a spider's hands. Yeah, okay, I don't want no spider's hands, bro. Why not, bro? You thing, can hold bro. so many more things. But what, you don't the, need hands when it's the old lady, What did the old lady eat second? What? A spider. That's how small they are. <laughs> what lady? Who once bro? was a lady who swallowed a spider, swallowed a spider to catch the fly. My oh my, she swallowed a fly. Horse. What is that, bro? You, never you made heard, that up. You never heard Nobody's about Nobody's ever night. heard that, bro. Oh, my gosh. You're from the eastern shore of I didn't <laughs> listen to children's stories? Bro, with spider hands, you could climb walls. No, you, you can't. Can hold, you can hold whatever you want. Spiders to the equivalent of their body can hold so, things so much heavier. But they're on my body. Right. So they're not <laughs> holding anything. <laughs> Unless you give me Spider Man's hands. No, you get Spider Hands proportionate to your body, so the full hand would be a Spider Hand, but it's the full so hand. So you're changing it up. I'm just. So you're changing it up. It's just proportionate. Now you're saying it's proportionate. <laughs> I always said it was proportionate. Now you're saying it. I never said it wasn't. You just don't get hands, bro. Would you rather fall on a porcupine or a cactus? <sighs> a cactus. 
Because I feel like if you if you land on a if you land on a porcupine, it could have been his fault. But if I land on a cactus, it's my fault. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So you're just doing it to take the blame. <laughs> yeah. So at least I know like. Then I'll, then I'll have a vengeance against porcupines. Like, I don't want that hatred in my heart, bro. If, I, if it's after a cactus... They're all accidental. No one's in charge of... But how do I know for sure, you know? I am just told you. <laughs> it was an accident. Porcupine didn't even know you were there. But what if I kill the porcupine? You probably will. You're a very heavy guy. <laughs> okay. Would you rather fall on a cactus? <laughs> yeah. On your hands? Yeah. Or land on your feet? On my feet, bro. On my hands. Taking hands. It take longer. To, it would be a quicker healing process. You know what I'm saying? Would you rather take a cacti in the eye? Or what? Or in the hands? No. Cacti in the eye or a cacti in the. <laughs> I don't know what else to say. Because an eye is really bad. I was trying to think, like, I couldn't say anything because everything. Uh, uh, yeah, I'd definitely rather take a uh, cacti or in like my rectum. In the rectum, yeah. Yeah, definitely you'd pick rectum. No one wants them in your eye. Oh, I don't know, man. You're going to go blind. <laughs> You're never going to be able to You're poop. You're going to go again. blind. You're going to poop blood for the rest of your life. Not the rest right? of your life. You're going to heal up. It's only quick. one eye. Then you can wear an eye patch. You can be a pirate. No, there's things not, you can do with there's it. There's nothing. You're not coming to a pirate, bro. You're not if gonna commit. Is to it a both eyes or one eye? It's 2022, man. <laughs> what does that mean? Not a lot of pirates left. Yeah, around here. When was the last time you seen a pirate? I've never seen a pirate. You live on the eastern shore of Maryland. You never seen a pirate? <laughs> That's like home base. It's not home base. What's bro. home base? What's pirate home base? Madagascar. The Caribbean. <laughs> you been watching they made movies? a movie called Pirates of the Caribbean. Bro. Right, where's the Caribbean? It's, it's like um. Is it a Caribbean or Southern, a Caribbean? Southern. What? Is it the Caribbean or the Caribbean? Pirates of the Caribbean? Pirates of the Caribbean. If I'm saying the movie, it's Pirates of the Caribbean. If I'm talking about where I want to go, I'm going to go to the Caribbean. <laughs> Man. Do you think... Have you ever experimented with different sleep cycles? What does that even mean? Like, normal sleep cycle is you stay up for 16, you sleep for 8. That's normal. There's some of them... Where, like, instead you sleep two, three-hour shifts throughout the day. There's some where you sleep three, two-hour shifts throughout the day. So you're no. sleeping less, and you're up more. No. <laughs> What's your opinion on mouthwash? Man, I'm torn, because I just got some. <laughs> what do you mean you're torn, bro? Like, if you asked me three weeks ago... <laughs> You know, I might have tore into it, uh -huh. but I just got some. And? It comes in handy. Explain. You know, just like, it's like a band-aid for your breath. Mm -hmm. Like it's going to hold you over a little bit, you know? Yeah. Like you're like, oh. I can go into this. Into what? Like, what scenarios do you do it before? What situations? I don't. But you can. And that is what I'm... America. <laughs> okay. I seen somebody say, what did he say? He said, uh... It only two things better than America. Yeah. Nothing in America. <laughs> Something like only, only two things I love more in America. Yeah. Nothing in, in America. America. That's what he said. I don't know who it was. It's funny though. Uh okay. What foods give you uncontrollable gas? Man, whatever I ate right before this podcast. <laughs> Flax seeds. <laughs> Yo, Thai food gets me, bro. Cinnamon toast crunch. Can't eat it. Cinnamon Toast Crunch is a wild card, man. You come back to that after about 15 years and give her a sweet taste. I can't do it, bro. I can't even do milk anymore. What time? How many will be in? Man is calling me. I got another call coming in. This is chaos. I got three calls. <laughs> My video stopped recording. Catch you next time. See you later. <laughs>